Hello everyone, welcome to solve this nice math Olympiad algebra problem. So here we have 25 to the power of m minus 15 to the power of m equals to 9 to the power of m. And we need to solve this problem for the values of m. So here the very first step we are going to do is here first we need to divide both of the sides by uh, 9 to the power of m. Okay, we divide both of the sides by 9 to the power of m of each term so we write it as 25 to the power of m divided by 9 to the power of m minus 15 to the power of m divided by 9 to the power of m equals to 9 to the power of m divided by 9 to the power of m okay so further you see here uh, this 9 to the power of m is cancelled out by this 9 to the power of m and uh, this implies that this is 25 over 9 and you see here the exponent of these two terms are same so we write it as 25 over 9 and its exponent is m minus we write this as 15 over 9 and its exponent is m and this is equals to 1. so further you see here uh, we rewrite this uh, exponential equation as we know that 25 equals to 5 square and 9 equals to 3 square and its exponent is m minus we cancelled these two terms by the table of 3 so we have 3 5 are 15 and 3 3 is a 9 so we obtain 5 over 3 to the power of m equals to 1 and now in the next step here you see that uh, the exponents on these two terms are same so we combine the exponent of these two terms and it will be written as 5 over 3 square and its exponent is m minus 5 over 3 and its exponent is m equals to 1 okay so further you see here uh, here we need uh, to interchange these two values we move this 2 to the outside of this square bracket and we move m uh, to inside of the square bracket okay uh, so when you interchange these two values we will obtain here 5 over 3 to the power of m and its whole square minus 5 over 3 and its power is m equals to 1 so further in the next step here uh, we convert this exponential equation into the quadratic form uh, by taking uh, y is equals to 5 over 3 to the power of m so when you take y equals 5 over 3 to the power of m so that our bob equation is written as in this form uh, we write 5 over 3 to the power of m equals y so this will be equals to y square minus this is equals to y and the whole equation equals to 1 so further in the next step uh, this will become quadratic in y variable but not into the standard form so now we write this into the standard form uh, by moving 1 from right hand side to the left hand side so it will become y square minus y minus 1 equals to 0 okay so further you see here this is quadratic equation and now we solve this by using the quadratic formula so first we write the coefficients of this equation and its coefficients are a equals to 1 b is equals to minus 1 and c is also equals to minus 1 so these three are the coefficients of the above equation and now we write the quadratic formula as y is equals to minus b plus minus square root of b square minus 4 times of ac divided by 2 times of a so now uh, we need to substitute the values of a b and c here so this uh, quadratic formula is written as this is minus b so the value of b is minus 1 we will write it here minus times of minus 1 plus minus square root of b square b is minus 1 square minus 4 times of a is 1 and c is minus 1 and it is divided by 2 times of a so here our a is also 1 okay so further you see here uh, we need to simplify the terms and we write it as this is minus times of minus becomes plus 1 
plus minus square root of minus 1 square equals to 1 and this is minus times of minus becomes plus 4 times of 1 becomes 4 and it is divided by 2 times of 1 is 2 okay so after this step we have y is equals to 1 plus minus square root of 5 divided by 2 so these are the two values of y uh, so now here uh, we write these two values of y separately on here so first we write the positive value and you see here the uh, positive value of y is 1 plus square root of 5 divided by 2 and the negative value of y is 1 minus square root of 5 divided by 2 so these are the two values of y and now here we need to move uh, backward uh, and you know that we take y equals to 5 over 3 to the power of m so here we need to back substitute this value of y to the above equation uh, above two cases so when you put uh, this value here it will be written as 5 over 3 to the power of m equals to 1 plus square root of 5 divided by 2 and this will be written as 5 over 3 to the power of m equals to 1 minus square root of 5 divided by 2 okay so after this step uh, first we focus on the second case and in the second case you see here uh, this this will be the negative value and uh, you know that uh, our right hand side will be negative but uh, our left hand side is the exponential function so you very well know about this step a, a, an exponential function cannot be gives us the negative value or exponential function always gives us the positive value so that uh, we will uh, uh, we cannot write this type of air so it is not possible uh, so we rejected this case and we will proceed here uh, this case only and in this case in order to find the value of m we need to take the log on both of the sides so it will be written as log of 5 over 3 to the power of m equals to log of 1 plus square root of 5 divided by 2 okay so further in the next step we need uh, uh, to move this exponent m in the front of this log and we write m times of log 5 over 3 equals to log of 1 plus square root of 5 divided by 2 okay so further uh, in order to find the value of m we need to divide both of the sides by log 5 over 3 so when you divide both of the sides by log 5 over 3 it will be written as m equals to log of 1 plus square root of 5 divided by 2 and this is divided by log of 5 over 3 okay so here uh, we write this expression as in this form log of base 5 over 3 of 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 so this is the value of m in this problem and this is the final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos